Maryland schools made a difficult decision tonight on whether or not their students will wear masks for the start of the school year. First News reporter Jason Surjack was in Poland tonight with their decision. With just three days before the start of school, the Board of Education needed to make a decision on masks in the classroom. At tonight's school board meeting, many were pushing the board to make the choice to wear a mask optional for their kids. For our kids to be in the least restrictive environment possible and a very nurturing environment that they can grow both emotionally and also, also de continue to develop as students as the school year continues. These parents believe their request for parental choice is reasonable. We need some definitive answers and, you know, we're not, we don't feel like we are asking for something completely, you know, preposterous. Ultimately, the board followed recommendations from the CDC and the County Board of Health and voted three to two in favor of a mask mandate. Uh, we listened to every single person tonight. We didn't have to. Uh, the board um, listened to every single person and, and even people that didn't sign up. Uh, I feel bad for the people that, you know, are, are, um, didn't get what they wanted tonight. The decision comes with a few wrinkles. The mask mandate is only for kindergarten through sixth grade and only for 20 days. For students in grades seven through 12, masks will be optional. Um, the amendment was made because K to six has no option to vaccination. Uh, therefore, um, it, it, they wanted to protect those kids. The superintendent also addressed concerns about the lack of mask use at the recent football game. Night was based on classroom, uh, K-12 classroom indoors. The, uh, the, the football game and football games going on across the entire nation is a completely separate. The decision of whether or not to extend the mandate further or to apply it for more or fewer students will be decided at the next regular meeting in September. In Poland, Jason Serjak, WKBN 27 First News.